My apologies, but before we begin today's video, I need to ask you all a serious question, and I need a serious answer. The question is this. If you were punched in the face unprovoked by a big, strong, hairy gay man, is that technically considered a bear attack? Dun dun dun. <laughs> <laughs> Well, holy ah, shit on a stick. Well, holy sh nickel fritz. Polish my nuts, serve me a milkshake, and call me Shirley because it's Shirley time for another special edition episode of Darth News Special Edition. Because it's Shirley time for another special edition episode of Darth News Hero of the Week. That's right, welcome back, dudes and dudettes, to another episode of Hero of the Week. And today's hero is someone who fended off a bear. Yes. And before anyone goes into the comments and, and, and mentions this, I'm just gonna bring it up. Uh, the fact that I've made, what, three or four videos about bears in the last five weeks or so, does not mean it was on purpose. It was not by design. It was fucking random. Okay, I don't go looking for, for headlines or news stories about bears. That would be weird. The stories find me. Okay? First and foremost. Just by sheer chance, this week's Hero of the Week involves a bear. So... Fuck bears, you know? Today's story is about a Canadian warrior who recently proved how big her balls are. Yes, her. That's right. This battle-hardened warrior is a woman. Yeah, a woman. I know, it sounds impossible, but it's the truth. It, it is, women are not warriors. They don't know how to fight. What Wonder Woman is a, is a fake movie and it's fan, it's not real. No, nobody's like Wonder Woman. No, women, women can't be warriors. That is impossible. Well, what, what about the soldiers in the military? What, what about them? The, they're not warriors. They're just little foot soldiers, you know, just getting a paycheck. Nobody needs them. They just sit on the computers and, and, and shit, you know? Oh, I don't know about that, Darth. That, that sounds a little bit misogynistic, you know? You sound like a misogynist. Like a little bigot. You sound like a bigot. A big old bigot. Wait, what? No, no, I assure you that is not misogynistic, Applejack. Yeah, no, yeah, I'm pretty sure it is, yeah. There's nothing misogynistic about that. It is. No, no there's not. Yes it is. No it's not. It is. It's not. It is. It is. It's not. It's not. It's not. Is, 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 is. Not. Is not. Is, 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 is. Is. Ah, ah, ah. Gotcha. Anyways, this woman with balls of steel proved her frontier medal by literally standing up to a bear that attacked her dog and her and chasing it away with a fucking shtick. I'm gonna repeat that. She chased it away with a stick. I'll repeat that. She scared a bear away with a fucking stick. Okay, so I'm gonna give you a little description of the video that we're about to watch even though you're about to watch it. But let me just give you like a little breakdown. So in the video, you see this woman who's in her yard and you see her dog come running around the corner and a bear is just like right on its ass, charging it like a big black bear. Huh? That's not racist. There's, there's black bears and there's white bears, like polar bears. What do you do? Just, so this dog comes running around the corner and the bear is chasing it. And this woman like thinks on her feet. She, I mean, I don't, I don't even know what she was thinking. But she just like steps in the way and like just smacks the bear with a stick. And the bear like kind of jumps on her and throws her to the ground. And then she gets up and like goes, Rawr! and scares the bear away with a stick. In the reports, it says that her adrenaline was so jacked up that she didn't even realize that the bear is the one who knocked her over and like jumped on her. She thought she just like tripped and fell. She didn't even, she was like in, in like a dream state, like, like mind space, headspace. I can't talk. Yeah, clearly I'm not in the right headspace, Tina. Shut up. 
So anyways, it was only after she uh, watched the footage and was reviewing it that she realized how close, how close she actually got to death or serious injury. Man, I, the, 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 the balls, like, ask yourself this question. Is your dog worth it? Like, if my child was being chased by a bear, I'd throw myself on the line. I would just be like, take me instead. But a dog, it's like, oh, I don't know. Like, I don't know if I could like, Ugh. I don't know. I love Oscar to death. I, I, I love my new puppies to death, but I don't know if I could get mauled by a bear for a dog. But this woman didn't even think about that. It, it didn't even go through her fucking mind. She just straight, just, just, she was just moving. Her body was just like an autopilot. That's like that motherly protective instinct. Like, like she's like, so apparently the dog was fucking with the, with one of the bear's cubs. But you're fucking like, there's just, okay, this is like mama bear versus mama bear. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause dog owners, dog moms, they are mama bears. So, I mean, whether they own a dog or you have a kid, a mom is a mom and you don't want an angry mom. You should be more afraid of an angry human mother than afraid of a, an angry bear mother. The woman says, quote, I thought I had tripped and then we pulled out our security cameras and then we realized, no, the bear actually hit me. Phil told CTV News. So anyways, I just talk, 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 talk. So sorry. Anyway, let, let's just get into the video, watch it, and then I, we'll wrap it up. No, we're not having sex. Oh, no, not, no, not, what? Why would you think I meant it like that? No, wrap it up, like wrap up the video. What? Applejack, you have a lot to learn, my friend. Don't worry, you'll, you'll get there. But <sighs> I don't know who, who, who's teaching you these crazy things. Well, whatever, Applejack, you know what? Don't even, don't even worry about it. Just hit it. The article reads, Filion explained that everything happened in rapid succession as she was playing with her dog in the yard. She said her dog spotted one of the cubs and put it in a tree in the yard. And then the mother bear made eye contact with Filion and almost immediately the large bear started running towards Filion and the three cubs behind her. Uh, we've got it myself and my dog and the three bears all looking at each other. Filion explained to CTV News, the dog put one of the cubs in the tree and then the mom came after my dog and the fight started. You know what, let me know in the comments below, whether it was a black, brown, polar bear, grizzly bear, whatever the fuck, if it was a bear chasing your dog, would you do the same thing that this woman did? Cause this, this is some savage shit. This is some like boss level, you, you got balls of steel. And I, I'm not exaggerating when I say that, when I, it takes balls to, to uh, hit a bear with a stick knowing full well that that just might piss it off even more and it might not even hurt the bear. You know, most bullets can't even like kill a bear. You, you need like special bullets to, to take out a grizzly. So uh, a stick, <laughs> the chances of, of that working are, I, I think astronomical, but then again, I'm not a bear ex expert, so uh, don't listen to me, but moving on. So in conclusion, uh, I guess just try not to fuck with bears because, because they'll fuck you right back. Yeah, but I mean, if you do have to fuck with a bear for whatever reason, just uh, make sure you're carrying a really big fucking stick. Yeah, like not not like wherever you, like if you're in the woods, if you're walking around in the woods and there's bears there, just make sure you're carrying a big stick because apparently big stick means scary stick and bears don't like big scary sticks. It'd probably freak me out too if I were a bear because you don't know any better. You're like, oh my God, did that tree just come to life? And does, is it attacking me? You'd be so confused. You would think the tree was attacking you. I don't know. I sound like an idiot. Yeah, so that's all for now. Um, until next time, <laughs> make sure you pull out. That is P-O-O -O fucking L. And as always, please make sure to like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Hit that fucking merch store, Patreon. Hit all the good stuff. Support me, because it all, it all adds up. And it means a lot. Like, your support um, is, is the reason this channel is still alive, essentially. Not to get all sentimental on you, but uh, I fucking love you guys, you know? Like, without, without you, I wouldn't be here. I just wouldn't. I probably would have killed myself. Was that a joke? I don't know. No, I'm not suicidal. I, 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 I was. I, I, 
I'm just saying, this channel saved my life. You saved my life. And that's not a joke, actually. You did. Uh, but also, there, there's a Darth News urban legend that has been making its way around the mill, and uh, I just wanted to address it. So the urban legend goes like this. Uh, it says that if you, if you unsubscribe or you dislike a Darth News video, someone that you love dearly, that you cherish, will die. A very gruesome and bloody death. Slow, painful, bloody, and maybe sexual death. In like 40 or 60 years from now. What? What if, what if, uh, what if you don't love anybody? What do you mean? Everybody loves somebody. Even serial killers love somebody. How fucking, how fucked up are you? Would you, you would have to like literally not have a soul. I don't, okay, I, I, I'll answer the question, okay? So if, if you don't love anybody and you dislike the video or you unsubscribe, then you die instead of someone you love. But not in 40 or 60 years, you die like tomorrow. Is that how it goes? Oh, three days, seven days. It's a week, right? Seven days. Hey, uh, I got a question. I got a question for you guys. Um, do you think in the, in, the, in the Toy Story universe, sex dolls and, and sex toys, uh, do, they, do you think they come to life too? I'm just, I'm asking for a friend. Oh, he's just a friend. Why are you being so goddamn nosy? Shut the fuck up and mind your own business. No, I, I'm, I'm, no I'm not getting defensive. No, you, you, you're fucking with me. Yeah, I, I know it's a weird question to ask, but the, the friend that I'm asking for, you know, he's a little bit cuckoo, <laughs> you know? So, it's a weird question. Just, can we just move on? Can we just, for, can we just forget about it? Can we just, like, that would be fantastic. To all those who are unsubscribing, I want to leave you with this message. Good. Go on, now go. Walk out the door. Go on, now go. Walk out the door. Fuck, let me start over. Go on, now go. Walk out the door. You little whore. Turn around now. And go, because you're not welcome anymore. Something, something, something. Um, uh, weren't you the one who tried to hurt me with goodbye? You think, I get nervous when I sing. Uh, you, 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 think, you think I'd crumble, huh? You think that's it? I would just lay down and die? Go on, now go. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to think of the actual lyrics. Oh no, not I. Don't worry about me, because more will subscribe. As long as I know how to make Amber Heard videos, I'll stay alive. Oh, I've got, I've got all my, I got, I've got all my life to rant, and I, and I, and I, and I've got all my red pills um, to give. They will subscribe. I will survive. Go on, I'll go away. So, something like that. I don't, know, I don't know. Basically, fuck you. If you want to subscribe, is the is the is the Darth News legend actually true? I, a few people died, but it could have just been a coincidence. How many is a few? Like 19 or something? That's why I'm losing subscribers, because, they're, because they're, they're, they're dying. They dislike a video, and then they die. I don't know. That doesn't make sense, actually. God damn it, Applejack. That wasn't funny. No, I know. I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm just, I, I, no, I know it wasn't. I'm just saying. It wasn't funny. You know what's not funny? Uh, what's not funny is how YouTube gave my channel a strike and removed a video of the doctor talking about the truth about COVID and the vaccines and wearing masks. They struck my channel down, and now I have to go 90 days being a good little boy, which I won't be. Basically, I'm on the road to the channel being removed. Because I feel like now that I got one, I'll get plenty more. Yeah. Let's just pray that doesn't happen. Yes, I'm repealing it. Appealing it. Whatever. It's still under review. Manual review or whatever. But, you know. So, I don't know, download my videos while you can. I, I'm, I'm getting a little bit, I'm getting a little bit depressing, I know, but hey, it could happen. Like they could just go back to like some of my old videos and retroactively like just strike, 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 strike. Because I mean, I definitely don't follow the community guidelines by any stretch of the imagination. 
but but at least I have an imagination. So there's there's that silver lining. Uh, if anyone needs a friend, you know, let me know, because I don't have any in real life. I mean, I know this is real life. You're you're my friend. You're all, you're like my online friend. You're my internet friends. They are not my followers. This is not a cult. No, they're, 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 they're my viewers. Don't call them followers. That's, that sounds like a Jared Leto cult. No. Okay, yeah, no, it's, this is a cult for sure. This, this is the darkness cult. Just low, keep, it, keep it on the DL. Anyway, uh, if you unsubscribe, I really hope that I've, like, I re-earned your subscription because I don't know if I can keep doing this, man. But, you know, on the flip side, my Amber Heard video got like almost 8,000 views. That, that's, that's pretty cool, my last one. Maybe I'll make another TikTok uh, compilation video about Amber Heard so I can get more views. Why, why, why the fuck are you still here? Like, did you, did you expect something else to happen? Nothing else is going to happen. The video's over.